Hawkman from Australia, we better look away. I'm Shells, midday music break, and we're doing tribute to Star Trek, the 50th anniversary. And this is question number two. I've also got some fun facts, too. I'll tell you that when we get back. But, question number two. Did I put it, did I put it into, no, I did not put it in the chat room. My bad. So if you guys are listening to this show after it's air, like, for example, Stitcher Radio, SoundCloud, Podcasts, iTunes, and in tune in, the trivias only work when you're listening to the show live here on speaker. So let make sure you go to, let's talk about the music or LTATM radio and I'll link you here to speaker. And we do, I do this show every Monday and Thursdays from 10 a.m. To 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, which some people have adopted Seattle time. So try and get everyone in gear on these, these this show here. So the second question of the trivia for Star Trek: Who was the captain in the pilot episode of the original Star Trek? The question or the answer will be right after a King of Cool. This is a uh, Red Tree Religion. They're from Greece.
listen to my words Cause I love to play the screen while I simply have to stir It's the best thing to do We'll handle around in the lazy summer discos where the kings are We Let's talk about music, midday music break. All right, King of the Cool Red. Oops, I forgot who I taught, played. Hang on a minute. Red Tree, Red Tree Religion. Ha ha. Give me a moment. I'll figure it out. Ha ha. Kingdom of Cool. Okay, so we have our second question for our trivia. Who was a captain in the pilot episode of the original in 19? 1966 is a Star Trek trivia. The answer is Captain Pike, as played by Jeffrey Hunt in the original pilot, The Cage. Christopher Pike is a character in the Star Trek science fiction fa uh, franchise. He was portrayed by Jeffrey Hunter, sorry, Hunter, not Hunt, I don't know why, in the original Star Trek, the pilot episode, The Cage, as captain of the S USS Enterprise. All right, so now your next trivia question, question number three. Would you guys have a little bit extra time on this one because you guys get a break and one song? That's it. To find this answer. You don't know. Now, if you guys are just warming up and want to wait until we have merch, I understand that part. But, you know, it's not kind of nice to get to going first and see if you guys are going to enjoy the trivia and all the prizes we're going to be having here soon. So, anyway, that's what you guys are doing. Fine, but still, you know, let, us, let me know you guys are listening out there, all four of you. What, question number three, what was Picard's Boggs name? Oh, I remember this episode. Here are your choices. Lu Lucas, Lucius of, Bo of Bog, uh, B, six of 12, C, one of 73, or D, Lucif of Brog. Okay. Oh, okay. They add little things here. So there's your question number three. You can call in. The phone number is 360-464-4216. And I will put this in the chat room. Oh, hang on a minute, guys. I got to I gotta sneeze. I don't want to see. Hang on. <laughs> oh, shoot. I was going to try to. There you go. I didn't want to sneeze in the microphone and blow your eardrums out. All right. <laughs> Sorry. It happens. I have time to start any anything. 
Okay, so the trivia is in the chat room. What was Bakar's Brog's name? Go Google it. We'll have a small we'll have a small break, and then we'll listen to Jessica theme band uh, again in Greece, and we'll come back with the answer. Okay. Well, that was some boring music. Spike. Come on, where's the Justin Bieber? Where's the Katy Perry? Where's the Fallout Boy? Noddle, you have witch powers. Turn him into a chipmunk and feed him to the owl outside. I will do no such thing. We're here to talk about our website. HomeCanineNeutering.com What? No! InvaderPet.com Where people can check out our comic strips or locate bookstores selling bookmarks with our comics on them. So, listeners, want to see comics of me, Noddle the Witch, my pets Kaylee Cat, and Spike Beagle? Go to InvaderPet.com and check us out! Seriously, though, you guys really have a canine neutering website? Magical Things offers fantasy art for festival and everyday living. Featuring the fine arts and craft creations of Marjorie Delaney on practical printed products such as journals, mugs, costuming, wearable art, formal wear, and accessories. We also carry a line of magical supplies, including candles, oils, herbs, and limited ritual items. All items are created in a scenic studio space in Culpeper, Virginia, and available throughout the world online, as well as at festivals and events. Magical Things offers custom creations, too, such as costuming, illustrations, and more. Come visit us at MagicalFantasy.com. September 14th. Um, let's talk about the music. They're hyper. They have power rock and roll. They're here from Nakome and Seattle. Give it up for Strangely Alright. They're going to be on the show with me and Spider on September 14th at 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And followed by them will be Sleepy Pilot. You guys don't want to miss it. Two powerhouse bands from Seattle is going to be epic. Let's talk about that music.com. Woohoo! Let's talk about the music is starting. What is Let's Talk About the Music and why are you so excited about it? It's a podcast with controversial talk and a global mix of music. Oh, cool. How and where can I listen? Just go to Let's Talk About the Music.com and click follow to be sure to get all the info about the bands that are playing and see their music videos. Then click on Spreaker or iTunes to listen live and even chat with other listeners and the host herself. What day and time is Let's Talk About the Music on? Every Wednesday night from 8 p.m. to midnight Pacific Standard Time. I think I'll tune in. Thanks for the info. And now back to Let's Talk About the Music with Shells. All right, let's get back to the music. Just got seen Bam from Greece, Black Cats. <laughs> Show me your shot, 